this video, I'm going to show you the new ATI WAN model. So as you can see, these are a few examples that I've done. And this looks pretty good. You can download the workflow. I provided in the description down below. So now let's get into the video. As you can see, this is the GitHub page of the ATI. Any trajectory moment. So these are few uh, videos, YouTube videos, dings. So this is the van video wrapper by Kajai. Okay. So we're going to download this workflow right over here from the Kajai version. Okay. And these are all the hugging face website of Kajai. And you need to download uh, ATI from your uh, I'm using this one, FP8. So you can download this and put it in your diffusion model folder in comfy UI. Okay. Now let's get into the comfy UI. So before starting, just please like, comment and subscribe on my channel. So as you can see, here's the model loader, ATF. So this is the one sampling and here you have to write the prompts, everything. So here is the, so this is the photo we are going to take. Okay. So as you can see, this is the video that we got. It looks pretty decent. Only the left hand is a bit weird for this example. The other examples are working perfectly fine. So as you can see, this is the main node where we have to do uh, the spline. So where we have to trajectory, uh, so what should move and what should not. So this is the main thing. So I'm going to tell you how to do this. So this orange thing over here, this is the main part. We have to, if I want her shoulder to move, so I'm putting it over there. If you want her head to tilt, so put the orange thing over there on her head. Okay. So, as you can see, she's moving her shoulder and the body over there. Okay. So I'm going to save this workflow for now and I'm going to show you a few examples more on how to use it. So in this, this is the 14 billion parameters. So this will require a lot of VRAM as well. Uh, so this one I'm doing in the RTX 49B. So as in my previous video, I told running hub, this uses 49D. So as you can see, I want her hand to lift up and and she should bend down. As you can see, she's doing that exactly as I wanted. So as you can see, this, this one is very good. Uh, let me just save this workflow for now. Now I'm going to show you uh, another example, we'll take another model, so we'll take this one. So as you can see right over here, this is what we got. This is good, but this was made by mistake by me. Uh, the motion, uh, that's why I'm showing it, it's still it looks pretty good. So now I'm going to show you uh, the steps and all. So this is 10 steps because I'm using a uh, Causewid LoRa. So that requires only 10 steps and one CFG. Okay. So this is the 
text prompt and I didn't change from this ferry and still this happened. So pretty good. So I'll show you one last example after this. Okay. So as you can see, this took around two two minutes in the RTX forty ninety. So this RTX forty ninety is not that powerful now uh, compared to the native one because I'm using in the running hub this side. Okay. So it will take much less time if you have a native RTX 4090. So this is the last example. So this is what I did. I want the girl zoom out and the wind blowing. The woman drinking open water on the beach while wind blows her hair. So as you can see the wind is blowing and it's zooming out like that exactly like i wanted so this is also pretty good and now i'm gonna uh, bypass the cause video laura to see the result for how much better or worse it is and compare it okay and now i have bypassed it and i'll change the steps i'll increase the steps obviously i'll increase it to around 25 steps so it becomes better so the cause with laura took three minutes 18 seconds and let's try and run this and see how much time does it take without the cause with LoRa in this running up if you want you can uh, use my code below to get 1000 free uh, tokens so we got the video and this Everything else is the same. Even the prompt is the same. So this is the video that we got. So this also looks pretty good. I don't feel any difference between the two. So now let's compare this. This one in the video player is the cause with uh, Laura. With the cause with Laura. Let's see. Yeah, the cause with Laura has degraded a little bit. But the left video looks uh, more authentic, uh, realistic. Okay, and a little bit detailed as well. So, yeah. if you want, you can use the normal without the cause with Laura. So, that will get you better results as well. So guys, let's end this video right now. Uh, if you guys like this video, then please do like, comment and subscribe to my channel. It helps my channel to grow.